11 Alive News at 5 p.m. starts now. First at 5, we are following breaking news. The GBI now investigating after a 62-year-old man died following a physical struggle with APD, Atlanta police. Good evening, everyone. On this Friday, I'm Jeff Hollinger. And I'm Jennifer Bellamy. We spoke with that man's family, and we're sharing those new details for you tonight. So let's get you straight out to 11 Alive's Brittany Kleinpeter, live from Atlanta Police Headquarters. Brittany. That's right. I just got off the phone with Johnny Holman's daughter. She tells me that she's been up for the last 24 hours, hasn't been able to sleep since this all happened last night. She sent me some pictures. I want to show you those. She tells me that her father was a deacon at Lively Stones of God Ministries and that he was a hard worker and a caring father. Now Atlanta police tell me they were called out to a traffic accident off Cunningham Place around 11 p.m. last night. They say Johnny Holman was the at fault driver at the scene and that he became agitated and uncooperative when an officer attempted to take him into custody. We know that at some point a struggle began and a taser was used. Now we don't know yet whether that taser actually struck Holman, but APD tells me once Holman was in handcuffs, an officer realized he was unresponsive. Police say he was taken to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. Now right now we do not know the cause of his death. The GBI says that they are waiting on an autopsy from the Fulton County Medical Examiner and of course we'll continue to follow this. Keep you updated both on air and online guys. All right, Brittany. Thank you so much. And to stay up to date with the latest information, download the 11 Alive News app. Just scan that QR code you see on your screen to download it for free. Well